here today to witness and celebrate the union of two dearly loved people. Bill and Julia wish to be joined in marriage, to accept one another in their entirety as lovers, companions, caregivers, and friends. This is a decision not to be made lightly, as it demands the greatest understanding of and respect for one another. Beyond the warmth and glow of romance, marriage means making the welfare and happiness of your partner at least as important as your own. Many of us here have been lucky to share in many moments with Bill and Julia to watch their love grow and deepen as they build their life together. While some people believe love is fated, a pairing of two halves destined to become one, I view it through the lens of science, where the most, best, life-altering loves are rooted in synergism. This occurs when two people come together to create a life far greater than they could have achieved independently. Over the years, I have watched Bill and Julia together and marveled at how they complement, support, and push each other. And you just know, this is it. This is love. Bill and Julia, you are joined here by witnesses of the best kind. To our guests, you are the dear and important people in Bill and Julia's lives, and you are an integral part to this ceremony. Bill and Julia would like to especially recognize their parents on this occasion. They offer their profound gratitude and all love for your love, care, and support. You have inspired them to become better people, and they thank you from the bottom of their hearts. Without you, this day would not be possible. 
There are some very special people who couldn't be here today, and Bill and Julia feel their love always. In particular, they would like to take a moment to honor their grandparents. Bill's grandparents, Pop Critch and Nan and Pop Jenkins. Julia's grandparents, Nanny Dix, Poppy Mann, Nanny Blanche, and Poppy David. Bill and Julia continue to feel the warmth of their love every day, and especially today. All of this love helps fill today's ceremony with meaning. It is more than just a moment in time in the lives of two people. This love weaves a web of support for Bill and Julia that will last throughout their marriage. It inextricably connects them to all of those present, both in body and in spirit, today and for the rest of their lives together. Bill, do you take Julia to be your wife? From this day forward, do you promise to cherish her? Do you promise to look with joy down the path of your tomorrows, knowing you will walk it side by side, hand in hand, heart in heart? I do. Julia, do you take Bill to be your husband? From this day forward, do you promise to cherish him? Do you promise to look down with joy the path of your tomorrows, knowing you will walk it together, side by side, hand in hand, heart in heart. I do. Wedding rings are made precious by our wearing them. Your rings say that even in your uniqueness, you have chosen to be bound together. Let these rings also be a sign that love has substance as well as soul, a present as well as a past, and that despite its occasional sorrows, love is a circle of happiness, wonder, and delight. May these rings always remind you of the vows you have made and the love that you feel in your hearts. With this ring. With this ring. I give you my heart. I promise you will never walk alone. May my heart be your shelter. And my arms be your home. With this ring. I give you my heart. I promise you will never walk alone. May my heart be your shelter and my arms be your home. Bill and Julia, before I pronounce you husband and wife, I want you to take these last few seconds of your ceremony and think about the happiness that you're feeling in this place, in this moment. Really let that feeling register in your heart and in your mind. Think about your future together and the adventures that lie ahead. We all know that your visions of the future, while not identical, are always complementary. For a dream you dream alone is only a dream. But a dream you dream together, that is reality. And your new reality starts now. By the authority vested in me in the Marriage Act, I pronounce you, Bill, and you, Julia, to be husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. You are my world. I love you more than words can say. As I stand here with you today, I know how incredibly lucky I am to have found you. Never did I think when I walked into the North Atlantic headquarters on Pippi Place all those years ago that this is where it would all lead to, that I would find you. Neither one of us had managed to make a good first impression on that day. You left thinking I was a know-it-all, and what can I say, sometimes first impressions are accurate. <laughs> And I was lucky enough for you to love me in spite of it. It might not have been love at sight, but our love was born from a deep foundation of friendship. I fell in love with your soul, with your tenderness, 
with your kind, gentle, giant marshmallow heart. I love how all things happy and sad pull at your heartstrings, whether it's screaming from the stands when the Habs score a goal or watching a sad movie together. I fell in love with the way you treat people, with the way you treat me, and how you make me feel. I will grow with you in mind and spirit through happy times and hard times. I will love and care for your family as I would my own. And I look forward to us creating our own family and raising them in a happy and healthy home full of love, travel plans, and Super Mario merchandise. I'll be your partner in all of life's adventures. For you, Bill, are my greatest adventure. I will forever and always love you more. Julia, you're my everything. The joy of my world and the best part of my day. The reason I smile and laugh and love those, this life we have together is all thanks to you. You are the most supportive, kind, caring individual. You're intelligent, adventurous, accomplished, and a joy to be around. I could not have asked for a more complimentary partner and teammate in life. I do not take for granted how fortunate I was to have found you. They say you can find anything at a convenience store. <laughs> but it usually comes, comes with a caveat. The product's either overpriced, shoddy, expired, broken, or a cheap knockoff of the real thing. So I was really lucky to have found you at the Orange Store because you were absolutely perfect. There was only one of you, and I've never once regretted them not having a return policy. <laughs> I promise to be there through all the good times and bad, and share each moment of this precious life with you. I look forward to, to a fulfilling life together, and I'm the proudest man on this day to be able to call you my wife. Love you, Julia. such a tremendous honor for me to stand here as his best man in the fanciest clothes I'm probably ever going to put on to share with all of you just a few words about my friend Bill on this the occasion of his wedding. I think everyone else in this room who spent a big chunk of their childhood, adolescence, or early to mid adulthood at Rosina's house would agree with me that it was a pretty great home to grow up in. And I think it's in no small part because of the home he grew up in that Bill is the amazing person that he is. Uh, Bill has always been the type of guy you can count on. I know that whenever I'm in need, all I need to do is reach out and he'll be there. He's the sharpest attack and wickedly funny. With the group of guys we grew up in, uh, our love language was savage mockery. And <laughs> Bill can spit venom as deadly as anyone I know. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Katrina, and I've known Julia since early on in our med school journey. Julia's fun-loving, outgoing social nature stood out to me right from our orientation week, only to find out just how much more amazing she is as our friendship grew. Throughout our friendship, I've gotten to know Julia quite well, obviously, see my above rant, but I've also gotten to know Bill and the two of them as a couple. Their love for one another is obvious, uh, from the way they show such caring consideration for one another, to their cute back and forths and baby, to their ability to work together through challenges and how they revel in one another's accomplishments. Julia, I'm so happy you found your person, your love, your partner in crime, and your partner in life. I am so glad to be here to celebrate this special day with you. I have so much love for you both and the future that you have in store. Cheers to the bride and groom. And I want to just start off with this. I'm a strong mom. I have a strong daughter. And after this, I know I will need a strong drink. <laughs>
So I'm here to welcome Bill into our family, but first I'll start with Julia, my beautiful girl. Julia was always an active, smart, curious, and lovable child. Always had lots of friends from elementary school through to this day. She excelled in school, which continued into med school, and here she is today, a psychiatrist and a beautiful bride. Most of all, she is beautiful inside and out. The most caring, loving, kind, best friend and daughter anyone would want to have. Bill, you and Julia complement each other in so many ways. My wish for you both is to keep your journey that you are on adventurous, fun, exciting. Cherish and love each other and always be there to lift each other up in good times and the bad. Bill, you are thoughtful, kind, and caring, and you make my daughter very happy. What more could a mom ask for? Congratulations, and I love you both. Hello, my name is Rosina, and I'm very proud to say that Billy is my son. And now Darlene can take over for me. Thank you. <laughs> I am very shy like Billy. <laughs> I guess you know who had the most drinks there. <laughs> I love you, bud, she says. You have always made me proud. You will always be my little boy. You have made your mama's wish come true, knowing you have found the love of your life in Julia. And for me to be able to be here today as you both start a new chapter in your lives. I love you, Billy. Billy and Julia's personalities complement each other so greatly I couldn't be more proud of them both. Julie is an intelligent, fun-loving person who always has everyone else's best interests in mind. You can tell her and my son truly love each other. Julie has been a part of our family for, for many years already, and today I would like to formally welcome Julia into our family. My advice to you both is to keep the lines of communication open. Never go to bed upset, cherish each other, as you always have. Enjoy and create new memories as you embark on a new chapter in your lives. We love you, Julia. I would like everyone to raise their glass as we toast to Julia and welcome her in to the Jenkins family. where you are, where you've come from, what you believe, we all know one thing to be true. Love is what they're doing right. That's why you, Julia, and you, Bill, are standing here. That's why all of us are here to watch as they stand up here. We have all loved in our lifetimes, and in this moment, we are reminded that the ability to love is the very best part of our humanity. <laughs> 